Hey everybody, Matt here. What's going on? Happy day to you all. Hope everybody is doing well, and I hope everybody is jumping on and taking advantage of the whole uh, half price on the uh, book, because that's going on for the entire month of June, and on my birthday, I'm going to try to do something a little bit special, even more than what I'm doing for this, because I think, well, it's, 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 it's a good book, I promise you, I won't lie to you, and the best part is, is that it's half price now, so it's kind of more of a incentive, more of a reason for you to jump out there, be like, if you're on the fence of it, like, getting ready to hit that button, then you take it away, you're like, eh, I don't know if I should buy it or not, now it's a perfect chance to do that, so get on out there, purchase through the eyes of an interloper, and let's have some fun, let me know what you think of it, and be sure to hit that like, share, subscribe button with this video because as you can see i am not driving it is one uh, it is yet another day for us to read <sighs> another page but i don't have my partner crying with me today hopefully he'll be with us tomorrow so in the meantime let's hang out let's break dance a little bit let's enjoy another page please oh please enjoy it stay safe out there let's have some fun all right and here we go and as always we um Overlap. So I'll read a page before or a sentence before to lead into this page that we are divulging deep into. So let's have some fun, shall we? Here we go. <clears throat> I have my ankle thrusters that either keep me stuck on whatever I'm whatever ground I'm walking on or allows me to push off for a brief moment, allowing me to jump high or fall down with grace. The hologram camera is watching my every move as they look at me, explaining to me as they are looking through the books. In the head of every single Reaper has a tracking beacon. Even when the Reaper is dead, it still tracks. They continue to read on as they skim over stuff, but I don't need to hear. So the object that sideswiped you and took you took out your engine is probably in the, in the separated engine, eating at the inside, making it impossible for you to get back home. I shake my head and laugh, looking into the camera as I ask. I have to hurry to get out of here in time to salvage what I can is basically what you mean, right? They both nod as they look, as and the looks of hurry the hell up in response is all I get. Not in, oh, here's how you fix it, or here's how you kill whatever is in there. I'm on my own out here, meaning I have to put the dome on. I make my way toward the elevator and hit the button. I bring the tablet with me, listening to some shitty music they're playing. Can you, like, can you guys please turn that off? Uh, what's the matter? You don't like Enzian music? They ask as they turn it down. I shake my head as the door opens up. Hell no. Sounds like they're killing their young. We all laugh while I make my way toward the dome and pick one up. I take a few deep breaths as I slide it on, feeling it touch my shoulders and the feel of the film going over my body. I grab the hologram screen and bring the instructions on how to fix the engine, better yet, attach it to my ship. They are still with me. Uh, about um, They are still with me, talking with me about everything, filling my head with nonsense, stuff I don't even care about. The increase of Mobus sightings is getting scary, along with the Bandu-like creatures, they say, as I have time to discuss this. I bite the hook in hopes to find out what their takes on the subject was as I get ready to open the bay door. What do you think the Mobus is? Do you think it's made up, or do you think it's a real beast? Realistically speaking, it's possible for them to exist. They just need an endless territory to explore being that size. It's just for someone to catch one to prove it to us. Till then, the ships get rocked or damaged with the sizes of their tails, and and they, they come crashing down, he explains, as he uh, was a damn expert on this. It doesn't help that they all move together, too. They're just too massive to see with those small eyes. The suit is virtually weightless as I lift my arms, testing out the elasticity of it. Um, it can withstand any amounts of pressure given to it, so it should... It should be fun to test it out. I open the door that allows me to step out into space, feeling through the air gushing past me like a suction that has just been opened. I turn my thrusters on. I tur turn the thrusters on my feet as I step onto the ship. I take a deep breath since I have never done this solo. I ask the boys, how do I turn the dome screen on so I can use both my hands? And that is yet another page of through the eyes of an interloper, chapter two. What'd you guys think? What do you think a Mobus is?
What what what, what do you think? Uh, what was that one? A bond do is. What what do you right? Yeah. What do you think a bond do is? Well, tomorrow you get to find out what the bond do is. Hopefully they discuss what a mobus actually is throughout the like, upcoming chapters. So. Thank you for stopping on buying. Do me a solid. Hit that like, share, subscribe button down below or on the side, whatever the hell it is that you're doing. So you can actually, and don't forget to hit the little notification bell so you can be notified when a new video comes out. Which is hopefully every single day that I'm off of work. So as you can see, I don't have a vest on so I am not working today so thank you for stopping on by it's been a lot of fun hanging out with you guys tomorrow hopefully i'll have my little guy with me and we will read another page of through the eyes of an interloper so be sure to hit up that sale for the month of june tell your friends tell your neighbors shit tell freaking strangers in the grocery store or getting your car worked on sit next to them and be like hey there's a book called through the eyes of an interloper that's half price now go find it and where do you find it at? Well, let's take a look here. We have Kindle, we have Apple Books, we have Kobo, and we have Nook. We have a few other random places, and if you need to know any more, please don't hesitate to message me. Until then, have a great day, everybody. Please be safe. Once again, thank you for stopping on by and hanging out with me. Take care of each other and your neighbors. Bye, everybody.